Hello everyone, welcome to our Timeless Early Hours Tarot. So this is a tarot reading at the early hours of the day. Now this is a timeless reading, so it is open to all zodiac signs. Okay, it's a general reading and it is open to all zodiac signs. It is also timeless, so anytime you find yourself watching this video, there might be a message here for you. Now let's try to see what is the main energy at the early hours of the day. Okay, we have your date of cups. A chapter is closing and you are walking away and you are starting to go towards a new chapter in your life. Something that is promising. There is light at the end of the tunnel. So, uh, a chapter has finished. You see here, you've already organized everything. Everything is already finished. You've placed things in order and it's time for you to walk away. Now, the number eight attracts me right now. It's as if the card is saying, now that a chapter has closed and a new chapter is opening, limitless possibilities awaits you. Very beautiful card. There is a certain sorrow, but there is also a certain resoluteness in your spirit that it truly is time to begin a new chapter. Now, let's try to see how this will further unfold. You will be given many choices and your spirit guides will be very happy to guide you to help you make the right choice. Enjoy the process of choosing. Choose something that makes you happy, something that is close to your heart, something that will set you on fire. With the Nine of Pentacles. Oh, very interesting. There's a series of numbers, no? But from the Cups to the Pentacles. So something, the Eight of Cups is leaving something behind that is close to your heart. Now you are being given a lot of choices which will be, give you stability. But as you make that choice also, choose something that is close to your heart. Something that will make you happy. Something that will set you on fire. And listen to the guidance coming from your inner self. Listen to your guides. They know how you can reach your goal. They will help you make the right choices that will lead to much better choices and then other choices and sooner or later it will lead you to the goal you are aspiring for. So uh, it, you see here this bird is hopping from one pentacle to another. So it means for some of you there will be a series of choices you will have to make and it is good if you allow your guides to lead you to the right pentacles so that you will be able to make the right choices and it will lead you to the goal you are aspiring for so listen also and allow yourself to be guided by the spirit now what is advice of the universe for us Enjoy the process of choosing. Again, we have the Nine of Cups. Both number nines are showing and also number eight are showing that a chapter is ending and a new chapter is waiting for you. Now, here again, choices. There are a lot of cups, no? Celebrate with these cups. So, it can be celebrate your relationships also. You see, you, I could hear the birds outside also celebrating with each other. So, it's like you need to celebrate also this moment of uh, transition with your people who whom you love people who are close to your heart you see the cups can symbolize the hearts of those people who are close to you and you jump in jubilation with the cups so you celebrate this moment of transition this moment of release from the past and this moment of anticipation of a bright limitless future with the people you care for with the people you love Celebrate it with people who are close with you. Celebrate the choices that are being given to you. Ask advice also. Ask your friends to join you with you as you make the choices. Help your uh, make the choices together with them. Ask their opinions. Listen to their suggestions. Of course, the choice will always be yours. In the end, the final choice will still be yours. But it's nice to celebrate it with your friends. Now let's go to the oracle reading.
The gift of neutrality. Balance is at work in your life. Yin and Yang are opposites in energy but reside side by side to create the gift of neutrality. Okay, so as you begin a new chapter, as you close another chapter, when you make choices, choose something that is in the middle road, something that will yeah, will allow you to attain balance, uh, holistic growth. So something wherein you are jubilant in your exterior realm and also peaceful within. Something that will set you on fire, but at the same time also something that will bring you peace and harmony. So uh, attain something that will lead to harmony. Take the middle road. So a new chapter is beginning. Take the middle road. The best road towards perfection is the middle road where both the masculine and the feminine, the, ex the external and the internal realms are equal. So um, try to take the middle road. So it's a good advice for us. As you leave one chapter and you jubilantly welcome another one, uh, remind yourself to always take the middle road to take that to grasp or to reach out for that gift of neutrality a balance between the opposites well that's it for today i hope you were able to benefit from our early hours tarot thank you for the likes and comments you've given to the channel thank you for subscribing i hope to see you again soon until that time may god continue to bless your ways